All right, Shalom. I want to say, Call Halayim, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh, Shah, Bahashim, Rakaku, Das. All right, the water, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh, Shah, for the Rakaku, Das. Double honor to the positive elders of the great millstone. Peace, blessing, grace, and safety goes out to all the Akiyam around the world preaching this word in truth and sincerity, okay? Uh, real quick, man, just want to, uh, just want to come with a lesson, man. Just, uh, you know, a uh, uh, cooling man meditating, just thinking. Uh, just want to bring a couple precepts out, man. Going in on how our forefather, um, how Yahweh by Shimei Hashem would deliver uh, uh, the elect, all right, out of these said perils to come, all right, just as he delivered our forefathers, man, all right. Because, you know, watching the uh, LDS Swamba, man, he was just going into how basically how it is already written, man, the elect. Will overcome death. Will overcome uh, 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 the said perils, man. Will be, you know, in in the kingdom, man. The first fruits of the kingdom, and you know, I don't want brothers, um, uh, my brothers that are doing this in sincerity and truth are part of that elect number, man. All right, but just going in on how uh, it is written, okay, in the scriptures. All right, how Yahweh Shemuel Shai will deliver and have mercy on and save his elect. As he did the times of our forefathers, man, you know, and that's what we have to look look back on right right now, cause man, you know, hey man, look like uh, there's no way out. Esau uh, just taking over, all right. Shit just getting uh, realer, harder, all right. But hey man, we got these scriptures to let us know that hey, how about Shemuel Shai is going to deliver the elect, man, all right. Uh, from the upcoming destruction from the uh, from this bondage that we're in, okay. So I just want to get a couple precepts, man, on how man we can look at our our ancient forefathers, okay, and in the scriptures, all right, to see how he delivered them and use that, all right, that um, knowledge, all right, that wisdom and that understanding to apply it to uh, what Yahweh Bashim Yashah would do in the future. Okay, so you know this is real quick. Just want to bring out a couple of priests. All right, this is Romans chapter fifteen, verse four. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning, that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Yeah, man. All right. So these things that were written aforetime, the scripture was written for our learning, man. So we can look uh, at these things and be like, all right, the Lord delivered them. All right. Hey, I don't want to I could be delivered, you know? All right? He de delivered days out of the lion's den. All right? The three holy children out of the furnace. All right? He delivered uh, uh, Israel from the uh, Egyptians. Okay? And so on and so forth. All right? We can look back through these scriptures and see it. Yeah, how about Shemiah Shai delivering his chosen? Okay? So Romans 15 and 4. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. All right. So, hey, man, we use these things that we might have hope, man, and comfort. All right. Because it looks like, man, it looks like uh, it's no way out, man. All right. It looks like, uh, well, it actually it don't, man. You can see Esau society collapsing, but, you know, the flesh is, you know, every day you pull up to the fucking hood. All right. Working the same job. All right. Struggling to make ends meet. All right, look fucked up, but we know through uh, uh through the scriptures that Yahweh Bashim is going to deliver his let and give them uh, uh the king. All right. <clears throat> All right. Let me grab this first, man. Uh, this is First Maccabees chapter four, and I'm gonna start at verse six. But as soon as it was day, Judah showed himself in the plain with 3,000 men who nevertheless had neither armor nor swords to their minds. And they saw the camp of the heathen. This battery about to go dead. And they saw the camp of the heathen that it was strong and well harnessed and could pass round about with horsemen. And these were expert of war. All right. So this is uh, uh, our forefathers, all right, uh, outnumbered, out manhandled. All right. Okay out uh, equipped all right and look they had the faith of uh, our forefathers all right they used uh the things that were written for their uh, for their learning all right for hope all right uh 
Verse 8, Then said Judas to the men that were with him, Fear ye not their multitude, neither be ye afraid of their assault. Remember how our, for, for our fathers were delivered in the Red Sea when Pharaoh pursued them with an army. Yeah. All right, so Judas, all right, Judas Maccabees, all right, reminded his soldiers, all right, the Israelites that was with him, okay, getting ready for battle, how our, uh, how Bashimah shall deliver our forefathers in the Red Sea. All right, and that's the same thing we got to do. We got to look at these scriptures and see how Yahweh Bashimah shall deliver our forefathers, all right, and, and apply that to Adawar Ratazah, he will deliver us, okay, the hopeful elect, man, all right. Verse 11, that so all the heathen may know that there is one who delivered and saved Israel. Yeah, Yahweh Bashimah Shah, man. He's going to deliver and save Israel, man. Okay. Let me get one more real quick for this, uh, this Jack go dead, you know. Deuteronomy uh, 32 and 7. Remember the days of old, considering the years of many generations. Ask thy father, and he will show thee thy elders, and they will tell thee. Yeah, man. All right. So hey, we gotta uh, uh, remember the days of old, man. Consider the years of many generations. Consider our forefathers being delivered, man. All right, and, and have that in mind. That it is written in the scripts. We believe in the scripts, right? All right. I, I don't want to die. We doing the right thing for the Yahweh Bashim All right. I don't want to die. We are that uh, elect number. All right. The men, women, and children. That's a lot to be saved. I don't want Rathazai, he delivered. He de he's going to, he is going to deliver him. Just I don't want Rathazai that we are in that number, you know? So, hey, man, it's a lot of that the elect is going to get delivered, so we got to have that faith and that patience and that hope of salvation, you know? Okay? So, hey, so with that, I want to say, call Halal Yahweh by Shimei Shai. Shalom.